Hello my friends, we have Town Hall 9 attacks. Now, in this breakdown, a lot of people, this is the first one we're going to have, a, uh, the new uh, giants, healers, hogs, and bowlers in the clan castle. Very common strategy. Uh, so, what do you use at the Town Hall 9 level? How do you decide what to attack with? People say, oh, use Valkyries, use hogs, use these giants, use this dragon, all blah, 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 all these special units. It doesn't matter. Scrap all that. Attack with what you have upgraded first. Super critical to remember. Don't just attack because what YouTubers are saying. If you have Valkyries upgraded, attack with Valkyries. If you have your hogs upgraded first, use the hogs. Don't just throw in these uh, troops just because it's cool or whatever. You're trying to get the three star, of course. You know, this is a great strategy to use. Do I like it more than Valkyries? Honestly, this is what you should do. Why? If you're going to upgrade, upgrade your Valkyries and your Hogs. Especially the Valkyries, because Valkyries at the Town Hall 9 level are the only things that can take down a Town Hall 10 to get the 2 star. Hogs won't actually do it. The Valkyries will. Uh, and your Giants, you're not going to use Giants against Town Hall 10s. So, order of upgrade, well, of course your Giants are going to be upgraded early on. Uh, but Valkyries are key. Upgrade your Valkyries first. Of course, you're doing your heroes too, uh, and then, uh, of course, that golem helps too. But Valkyries and Hogs, I think the uh, Vaho attack at the Town Hall Nine is just as effective as this new strategy using giants and healers and all this and bowlers. But see, that strategy will never be able to take down a Town Hall Ten, no matter what. Maybe a one star, but two star. Uh, uh, you got to use Valkyries. So this is attack. This is what I like. This actually had more troops in at the end, I think. Didn't have the heroes here, but troop-wise than the previous attack. Now this is using a uh, typical go Vaho sort of strategy. Using Golem in the clan castle, some wizards to clear the path, create the funnel, and then main core of the attack is the Valkyries and the core. Now here he didn't bring a rage. I would have swapped one of the heals for the rage uh, and that way because Valkyries are s use rage so well. In fact, two rage might have been enough, but he didn't have healers, so I do like the two heals. Uh, two heals, one rage would have been perfect for this attack. Here comes the Valkyries. They almost The funnel was almost not created. He almost was a bit too late on those Valkyries. Luckily, they did path to the center. So, I mean, they have total destruction level four. I just did a video the other day, a Town Hall 9, two stars, a Town Hall uh, 10 and 11. Um, uh, so, uh, that is pretty, pretty impressive. Uh, so, uh, 911, uh, but anyways, um, so we are going to bring in the hogs as we speak. Of course, you, when you plot, drop the hogs, you drop them away from any double giant bomb possibilities. Some are already triggered. So, from here on out, it's pretty much over. He's got a lot of hogs left, a lot of troops left, and some wizards for cleanup. He's got one heal spell left. He's going to drop it now, going to heal those hogs, and the raid is completely over. I like this one a lot. He's got so many hogs left that I think this, honestly, troop-wise, there's more troops in the Go Vaho strategy. So, again, don't just do whatever, you know, floats your boat or whatever the next YouTuber is saying or even whatever I'm saying. Valkyries are the first thing to upgrade. Uh, and that's pretty standard as far as being able to attack the Town Hall 10. And that's why you do it. Here is a air portion of the attack. Uh, well, we're not going to show that one. Let me, uh, let me, let me find that was a Town Hall, Town Hall 8. That's uh, what I want. I want another Town Hall 9. Let's see, let's see, let's see. Here we go. This is using just the kind of the same sort of strategy. Low level heroes, mid -t tier level heroes against these bases. And this is pretty, pretty solid stuff. Of course, you're not bringing healers here. You're bringing your golems. Your golems are your healers in a sense. They are the tanking troops. Now, I don't like using Earthquake at Town Hall 9. Jump spells are way better. Uh, the, because see jump spells what happens with the earthquake see they get pushed towards the center of the base and those golems actually don't create the kind of protection the wizards need and if you had the protection the wizards need then uh, they'll st last longer as you can tell he lost a lot of wizards early on so jump spell instead and that would go way better um, than the earthquake plus you have an extra poison spell at that now this attack actually came down to the wire. He didn't have many troops left, but he had his heroes left. And why was that? Because he had the golems tanking for the heroes. The king survived, things like that. So 
attacking from with using the hogs away from any double giant palm possibilities actually i would attack come from the south instead he's about to run into some giant bombs but that's okay uh oh he, he planned it no giant bombs there looks like they're further to the south at that anyways guys there's some Town Hall 9 strategy for you. Uh, again, upgrade properly, attack with what you have upgraded. If you have all air troops and no ground, use air. Don't, for instance, don't just attack using ground troops because you don't have them. If you love air instead, use the air attacks, even though they're pretty difficult to do um, or just require some more skill involved. Um, I think the air portion, but I love air attacks. They're my go-to if I can use them. Anyways, thanks guys for watching. I appreciate it. Please subscribe, and as always, we will see you next time. Halo out.